Hey guys, Vampiro20 back again, and as you guys can see, Animal Crossing New Horizons has updated to version 1.1.1 as of today, and with that, it fixed a glitch. If you guys remember in my last video, we talked about how you can do a cloning glitch to make a ton of money, and Nintendo was right on top of it, and they went ahead and fixed the glitch, but in doing so, they created a whole other glitch that pretty much is ruining my experience with Animal Crossing, and I'm gonna go ahead and show that off to you right now. Now, I know a lot of people are probably gonna leave comments below saying, you get what you deserve, that's what you get for trying to, I guess, exploit this glitch to get rich in Animal Crossing, but at the end of the day, guys, this is just a game. I'm playing it the way I wanna play it, and I'm having a good time doing it, and wait till you guys see exactly what has happened to my town because of this glitch. If you guys remember, I used to do the glitch right here in front of Nook's Cranny, and as you can see, there is a royal crown with, for some reason, a Nintendo Switch on top of the crown. I mean, look at this. There is a Nintendo Switch on top of the crown. Now, what's the problem with this? I can't grab it. Like, as you see, I can't, it won't let me pick it up. I can't move it. Like, it's just completely stuck there. It's completely glitched out, and I can't go around it. You can try to use a shovel, and it doesn't do anything. So, as you can see, I'm going to go ahead grab a shovel right here and I can't dig it out or anything it's just it's like the game knows something there it's like in my view and I just can't pick it up it's like completely glitched out it's like Nintendo's pretty much trolling me right now letting me know hey we know you you know used this glitch and it's like it's exactly right there if you guys remember this is where I put the crown and this is where I put the box now before I was using the Nintendo switch but I found out the crown, if you sell it, you get 300,000 bells. And you can actually go ahead and sell it for 9 million bells. You can actually go right in there, sell every single crown you got, keep repeating the process, and they will offer you 9 million bells every single time. And this is the spot I used to do it in. And when I went to go try doing it today, for some reason, it just dropped the crown right there, like, off the box. And it has the Nintendo Switch stuck on top of the royal crown and you can't grab it you can't move it you can't budget or anything and it's like nintendo's little way to let me know hey look i know you use this crown and they threw the nintendo switch on top because that's what started it all and it's 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 stuck here forever i tried resetting the game multiple times and it is literally stuck there forever apparently which is going to stink because once i can start transforming my town and putting pathways in and all that stuff this is going to be an eyesore. It's going to be stuck in the center of my town. And what happens if Nook Crannies, you know, expands and it goes up to here? Is it going to block the entrance to Nook's Cranny? I mean, I hope they fix this glitch. So by fixing the cloning glitch, they somehow created another glitch. Hopefully they update the game again and they can remove this crown. Nintendo, for some reason you're watching this, can you just remove this crown and just get it out of here? I mean, I'm glad you fixed the glitch. But can you fix this one and just get this crap out of here? And if anyone's wondering why was I trying to get all that money, I was going to try to make a video to show you guys what happens when you max out your bells. Now, let me go ahead and show you how many bells I got by using this glitch because it's pretty insane. If Nintendo didn't take my money, let's go ahead and check. I haven't really checked. Who knows? Maybe Nintendo took my money as well. I honestly don't know, but we're about to find out. Hopefully not because that would kind of suck. So... Let's go ahead and check my uh, ATM here and see what we got going on. Um, ABD, and as you can see, we got 373,688,575 bells. That's a lot of bells. That's a lot of cash right there. And it didn't take long to do it. So today, my plan was to max it out at 999-999-999 because that's how it used to be in the uh, old Animal Crossings. And usually when you do that, they give you something really cool like an ATM machine to put in your house or a really cool reward. And I wanted to see what that reward would be in this game. And I was going to make a video on it today, max out my bells and show it off. But apparently that's not going to happen because they fixed the glitch. And I'll be honest, I don't know if I'll ever be able to max out my bells now because that's a lot of bells. So leave a comment below, guys. Let me know. Are you happy that they fixed this glitch? Are you upset because you never really got to take advantage of it and get all that sweet cash? Leave a comment below. I'm dying to know what you guys think. And what do you guys think of this glitch up here? Now this is completely stuck here forever. As you can see, it is still there. No matter if I reset the game or not, 
it is there. I can't move it. I can't pick it up. And now it's just a big eyesore in my town. My daughter absolutely loves it. She thinks it's hilarious. She's like, oh, that's something no one else has had. It's like a statue in the middle of the town as like a national landmark to let us know that we cheated. I don't know. That's pretty wild to me. At the end of the day, guys, I need to know your thoughts, your opinions. Let me know what do you think of this eyesore that I cannot get rid of. And that's pretty much all for right now, guys. And as always, there'll be more to come shortly. Thanks again.